final stage of Raymond in progress. Raymond must succeed! Component tray attached. Activate electroshock boost. Silcock as the Doctor, Benji Clifford as Davros. Doctor Who, Solo. Time and the Darlings by Connor Chadwick. Right, let's see. So many choices. Hmm. How about Earth as per Doctor? And 1856. I hope Romana won't mind me sneaking out. I'll let her fly the TARDIS later. Make myself feel better. She'll be none the wiser. Alright then. Victorian England, here we come. Where have you landed, old girl? Looks rather dark. The cupboard? Hang on. A light switch? In 1856? Have we taken a wrong turning? Again? Doctor! Daleks! Resistance is futile! Give me access to my ship, now! Silence! Uh, I don't think so! Why haven't you exterminated me already, huh? We need your help. <laughs> Whose idea was this then? You will cease your noise! <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. It's just. Why me? Of all people. You possess the necessary knowledge of the Daleks! Ah, oh, I'm just convenient then. We require your assistance, Doctor! What if I refuse? Then you will be exterminated! So you're not asking, are you? Will you help us? <sighs> well, I suppose I don't have much of a choice. You will follow! This is quite impressive. Where are we? You are on a Dalek scout ship! It's more reconnaissance of you all then. What's the point in having a Dalek Supreme when there are so little of you? Follow! Alright, alright. Wait, stop everything. Do not obstruct! No, seriously. Stop everything. What is your concern? I'm counting 20 Daleks in this room, including you two. Correct! And how many are there on this little scout ship of yours? 500! 500? How is this possible? The Daleks were extinct, well, almost. The Dalek hunting grounds, Doctor. Or did you forget where you left me to die? Davros. Yes. It's been a long time. That it has. Not long enough, I'd say. I see you back in your chair. No thanks to you. Why did you summon me? 
I did not. We have summoned you here to assist Davros! Assist? Judging by Davros here, he's not aware of this either. You will assist Davros! What do you want, Dalek Supreme? Time! Time? That's a very vague statement. Whilst within the hunting grounds on Skaro, our scientists were developing technology that could open the entirety of time itself! Silence, Dalek Consultant! No, don't be silent. Keep the goodies coming, why don't you? What are you hiding, in? Enough! You will assist Davros! <laughs> if I must. What if I refuse? We have restored you to life, Davros! We can easily disassemble you for other means! Davros is now restored! His life support machine is at 100%! Excellent! You will both follow me to the laboratory! Begin work! We shall return to receive an update! You haven't even told us what we need to do yet! Silence! The necessary information is prepared for you! Explain. Whatever do you mean? Don't play games. What trick are you playing? There are no tricks, Doctor. So we're at the Daleks' mercy, then? It would appear so. What happened to you? You corrupted the databanks of my cyborg form, leaving me for dead. Oh, I didn't leave you for dead. But you could have killed me, Doctor. That was a dark day for you. Yes, it was. I imagine it was not your first. Nonetheless, my cyborg form had a failsafe, a radio emitter. It got the attention of the Daleks. How can there be so many Daleks? The Dalek hunting grounds are filled with them. I didn't think there were so many. Not after the Time War. And certainly not after the Master used his weapon on Skaro. Every side had their secrets. Right. So what does the Dalek Supreme mean about time? I am unsure. Oh, come on, you must have some ideas. I don't know. Let us just look at what we have to work with, shall we? Very well. So, how peculiar. Not quite. Judging from these materials, we are creating an object that contains a huge amount of energy. Right, and the Dalek Supreme wanted time. You think what I'm thinking? Possibly. A rift, perhaps? Not quite. Oh, please, do go on. Naturally, this is about an element of time manipulation. There was a brief time during the Time War where the Daleks wanted a device known as the Time Wave. Time Wave? That is correct. Much like a wave washing up on the shore, this Time Wave would enable the user to access a fixed point in time and alter the outcome. Ever so slightly. So the Supreme Dalek wishes to change some elements of the war? It is a possibility. Perhaps the war could be won. A timeline where the Daleks win the time war. It hardly bears thinking about. I disagree. Well, I knew you would. I must build this immediately. What if it's not what the Dalek Supreme wants? What if it's more sinister than that? Any victory for the Daleks is a good thing. If the Daleks win the war, what happens to you, hmm? Whatever do you mean? Don't play dumb. You were on trial for years, always escaping and creating new Daleks. And not this time. With the war won, the Daleks have no need of you. Speechless. It is what I must do. Then I must stop you. Oh, will you now? Haven't you done enough? But that time was different. Was it indeed? Every time you have disrupted my plans, Doctor, you have always left me with a way out. I'd hoped you would be better. You've lost that hope. Yeah. I lost it when you threatened everyone I've ever known. You know how much they mean to me. I do. Just like now. I did what I had to. And yet you still talk to me like an equal. We are equals, Doctor. Locked in constant.
constant conflict for eternity. Even eternity must end sometime. Quite. Davros, please, try to think about this. The last time I saw you, you wanted to create new Daleks. Wipe out the rest, have a clean slate. Your point is... Why should you help them? These ones are clearly beyond reasoning. They'll kill you the moment you've served your purpose. What do you suggest? We build the machine with one fundamental flaw. That would be... Well, you see this particular material? A, a dimensional buffer. Just build without it. The device will work, but might become unstable. What would happen to the Daleks? Well, I can't be 100% sure. But it could give us a chance to escape. Why has work not yet begun? We were... just examining the materials. The Dalek Supreme refused to tell us any details. Are you attempting to deceive us? No, not at all. Yes, he is. Excuse me? What are you talking about? He attempts to trick you. Doctor, you will come with me. It's not like this at all. I shall assemble the time wave device for you. You have lied, Doctor. Follow. Davros, what are you playing at? You are in good hands, Doctor. What is the Doctor doing here? He was attempting to betray us! I wasn't! Explain! Your time wave device, it won't work. The Dalekanium won't withstand the amount of energy by harnessing time itself. You are incorrect! I'm telling the truth! It will simply explode in your faces. Well, I stops. <laughs> we have run all the necessary tests using similar energies. We have calculated every possibility. The machine will work. You can't be sure of that. Silence. Take the doctor to the cells. I obey. <sighs> well, that worked perfectly. <laughs> Trying to escape. Who's there? My name's Lance. Lance Pastar. Who are you? I'm the Doctor. Refusing to give you a full name. That is my name. Fair enough. So, you were trying to escape? Sort of. The Daleks wanted me to build something. I was trying to spin it against them, and they weren't buying it. You? I was in the hunting grounds. Back on Skaro. You were? Yes. I was one of the last ones left. I used to be a technician on Stowe. Do you know it? Well, I do, as it happens. The Daleks saw me as... Well... Useful. I suppose. Look, I'm just grateful I'm still alive. So... You know about the device I was made to assemble then? Yes. A time wave. So how are you still alive? Beats me. But there's something I've learned about the Daleks. It's that their days are numbered. There's only 500 of them left now. One Dalek would be enough. And now Davros is creating the device for them. Dalek! I require your assistance. What is the delay? No delay. The device is ready. Excellent! Remain here! I shall call the Dalek Supreme! Did you feel that? I think... I think Davros has built it. Damn. That was quicker than I was hoping for. We've got to find our way out. But we don't have anything. Hang on. I might still have a spare on me. Hang on. A spare what? A uh, screwdriver. Screwdriver? It's Sonic. So we can get out, right? Hopefully. Providing the lock is easy to crack. What's going on? Uh, the ship is becoming unstable. Arrgh! The door is jammed! Davros, explain this interference! Whatever do you mean? The scout ship is experiencing levels of distortion. Explain! The device is powerful, Dalek Supreme. This is obvious. You will activate the time wave. With pleasure. Time wave device activated! 
writing! Continue to observe the effects of the time wave! I obey! It's working! Doorway is open! Time wave ready to be dispersed! Do it! Disperse the time wave! Alert! Alert! We are under attack! Exterminate! Hostility will not be tolerated! Exterminate! Halt! Stay where you are! What is your designation? I am the Dalek Consultant! You are inferior! Where do you come from? Exterminate the Consultant! I obey! You have succeeded, Lord Davros! You doubted me, my child. Bring the others through. It is time that the true Daleks returned to the universe. Davros has used the time wave, the shot wave from it had jammed the door as I was opening it. Identify yourself! You are inferior! Exterminate! Oh! Get back against the wall! What's happening? I'm not sure, but whatever killed that guard, it was of a new Dalek origin. Prisoners detected within cells, they will be dealt with when the cleansing is complete. Right. The scout is gone. Help me with the door. Come on! Come on! I am! Right. Oh, we're through. Come on. How do we even get out of here? I have a ship. So we need to get to the docking bay? No. The transmat chamber. How do you expect us to fly out of here? With great ease, actually. Come on! Look! Dalek remains. What's going on? Well, I imagine that Davros has used the time wave and changed the Daleks. They now serve him, and any Daleks that oppose that ideology are wrong. Not quite, Doctor. Oh my god. You knew I'd come for my TARDIS. Naturally. What have you done? The time wave can be a dimensional portal, a gateway. Yes, to another time or place. So these new Daleks, where are they from? These Daleks are from a parallel timeline. A parallel timeline? Davros, before I even look into the details of such a claim, do you not understand how dangerous that is? Paradoxical, I'd say. Exactly! You could rip the universe apart! Every little thing was calculated. No such event will occur. So where are these Daleks from exactly? A timeline where the Daleks were allowed to flourish. Oh, so candid. What is he talking about? A universe without the Time War. It set us all back. The Time Lords especially. These Daleks serve me. They are the true new Dalek race. Weren't content in their own universe? Too content. I created the Daleks to rule. They crave a challenge. So you're putting the lives of everyone in the entire universe at risk just to challenge the Daleks? It's not so different from what you did to save your friends the last time we met, Doctor. I'm warning you, Davros. <laughs> no need for threats. They will get you nowhere. I have to stop this. You understand that? You must do what you feel is right. Get back! What have you done? Oh, the old shoot me in the back tactic, Davros. As always, you're predictable. What have you done? Oh, I haven't done anything. Other than save Lance and I's lives. You've done this. Lance, get to the blue box. That little thing. Now! You may have shut down the power in this room, but we will follow you. This scout ship has temporal abilities. Only in this room? <laughs> my, my, Davros. How naive are you? You got poor aim, Davros. You will stay where you are. I don't think so. 
Lord Davros, what has happened to the power within the scout ship? The, the whole ship has lost power. Correct! The Doctor. He did this. Where is the Doctor? He's gone, you fool. We must follow him. Negative. All power is down. Activate the time wave. We must create a doorway to escape. I obey. This place, it's... it's... Bigger on the inside, yes, yes, funnily enough, I know. Now, I've got to send out a temporal pulse from the TARDIS, disabling the Dalek scout ship from travelling through time. You can do that. Oh, this old girl may be a Type 40, but she's still got some life in her yet. Time wave device procured. We must activate it. Activating! Hold on, Lance! Hold on to what, exactly? Trans-temporal capabilities! Activating in ten rails! Nine, eight, seven, six, five! And done it! Now... Whew! To take you... Take me where? That can't be. That shouldn't be. Doctor, what's happening? No! No! Please don't be true! Doctor, talk to me. What happened? No traces of any life signs on the ship. What does that mean? They all... died? You'd think that, but the time wave device is no longer showing up on my scanners. Oh, no. I can only theorise that... that they used it in time. Davros and his new Daleks. They've escaped. I... I don't know what to say. Where are they now? Anywhere. I could trace it usually. There's always a small temporal signature left behind. But the temporal pulse has wiped out those chances. I see. Well, we've landed on Alpha Canes 5. A thriving city. Right. Will you be alright here? I should be. Someone will give me a lift. Or well, maybe I should just stay here. I'll figure it out. Of course. Thank you, Doctor, for saving me. <laughs> There's no need to thank me. Fine. But in that case, take this away from what happened today. They may have got away, but I'd probably be dead if it wasn't for you. You're... You're welcome. I hope to see you again, Doctor. <sighs> I survived. Again. They always survive. Oh, old girl. They never stop, do they? I just keep hoping that with the amount of Daleks I've seen since the war, there might be more time lots out there. Oh, well, Romana's awake. So, where to? How about a nice day out? Victorian England, wasn't it? In Doctor Who Solo, Time and the Daleks. Directed by Connor Chadwick. Oliver Silcox starred as the Doctor with Benji Clifford as Davros. Neil Duffield as Lance Pazdar and John N. Harper as the Daleks. Sound design by Connor Chadwick. Music by Big Finish Productions. Written by Connor Chadwick. Story by Connor Chadwick and Oliver Silcox. These audios are a non-profit fan series made for the love of the show. No copyright infringement is intended. <laughs>